It's a craze that's been sweeping the world, aimed at raising awareness for ALS or Lou Gehrig's disease. It's the Ice Bucket Challenge and it has caught on in Barbados, as you've probably seen on Facebook or Instagram. The local initiative is being spearheaded by soca artist Basil Yard Jr. and the funds go to the Chaloner Creative Arts Training Center, which caters to about 80 special needs students. If you're nominated, you have to be filmed having a bucket of ice water poured on your head. Then you get to challenge others to do the same. If you accept the challenge, you're required to donate $10 to the cause. If you don't, then it's $50. Mr. Yard has encouraged both corporations and individuals to give not just money, but time and expertise to the students who attend the school. I'm always hearing the term special needs. And we say that by rolling it off our tongue. Special needs. Not really taking in consideration the word special. Special meaning extra attention may, may be needed and so forth. Now, in an economic situation where we are now, where persons are being sent home and, and parents are, are struggling with their children who are normal, as we call it, what about those who have special needs? Therefore, we need to get back into that mentality of being a village and looking after each other and helping where causes our, our concern. One company responding to the call is Dial Barbados Inc., which contracts services to Lime. Employees took on the challenge on the Wickham Lewis Boardwalk today, where they were joined by Chief Executive Officer of the National Initiative for Service Excellence, Kim Tudor, and two of her staff members. Now it's your turn if you haven't participated as yet. But if an ice cold bath isn't your thing, you can just make a donation. This is Natasha Beckles for Nation News.